Hey guys, it is Monday and it's a new month, so I'm talking about different things. However, the only thing I can really think about is what is happening later on today, which is Tessie's EEG. And this is especially stressful because she is not going to be sedated during it, and so I have to get her to sleep. <laughs> just getting through it. Basically, the EEG is like the sleep study and it's just one thing that we have to get through and just get through today and get it over with. I sat here all day yesterday trying to think of what I was going to talk about today because I don't really want to talk about that and it's really all I could think about so I want to do something a little bit more lighthearted and not about anything medically. So my diaper bag. Let's see what's in it. I have not like cleaned this out or gone through it or checked it or anything like that. We are going to do a what's in my diaper bag <laughs> and we're going to see what's in it. And this diaper bag, it's one of a bunch that I use, but it is Calencom and I got it like when Maggie was a tiny baby, like when she was like a couple months old, I would say. Actually, I think she was like a month old and I got it to review for a company on my blog. And so that means it is almost eight years old now and it's still doing pretty good I would say for an eight-year-old purse that I've used a diaper bag that I've used for the past eight years as a diaper bag <sighs> okay the first thing in here is my planner and this is actually my vlog planner where I plan out posts and I like to have it not in digital form I like to have it in a like written planner I have a few planners. I like to have it in written form so that I can take it with me. I mean, I know I could take my phone stuff with me, but I don't always like doing stuff on my phone, and I like the written format better. So, this is my vlog planner, and it's the first thing that I'm finding in here. Oh, I saw And then there is my wallet, which is gigantic and full of Arby's coupons because we found some. We have found a fast food restaurant that Patrick actually likes the food at, and they sent us coupons, so I flipped them out. A whole bunch of receipts that I need to like throw out, one of them just flew out of my hand, and then just, yeah, general wallet stuff. So, my giant wallet, and it's sparkly, which is the best part about it. I got this at Target like a couple of years ago, and it is still my favorite thing, even though I've gotten other wallets, I always come back to this one. The next thing... I'm finding in here is Patrick's mini computer, the calculator that he got at the dollar store. I can tell it's Patrick because it has the blue on the side and he must have slipped this in here at some point because I didn't take it and put it in here. And some bills that I had to bring in utility bills to Maggie's school to confirm that we live in the district, even though actually we don't live in the district because she's bust and a diaper. There's going to be a lot more of these in here. It's Tessie's goldfish that she didn't end up actually eating before we got to the hospital because she fell asleep. Not one, but two Kindles. One with a little flippy cover though, and one without. That's like for emergency child distraction. And then, I'm looking, what I'm looking for right now is just so I can bring these out together. Two little boy ballet shoes. Patrick's ballet shoes and I just keep them in here because otherwise they disappear into the house and I think we have like at least four pairs of little boy ballet shoes that are similar in size to this so not actually this size that are floating around the house somewhere because he loses ballet shoes so I'm just keeping a pair in my purse all the time now okay <laughs> if I find another pair in here I'm gonna actually be upset though <laughs> next up wrapped in little boy underwear is a whole bunch more diapers and actually there are two pairs of backup boy underwear in here just in case because James is close to potty trained but there's still the possibility of accidents when we're out which is also why I have a backup pair of little boy pants in my diaper bag yeah let's just cut that right out <gasps> an owlette mask I totally thrashed my hair an owlette mask that Sadie wore for Halloween with her brothers. Oh, this is my camera's little switch that makes it take automatic pictures. 
because, let's face it, the thing that I am desperate for is like actually a good family picture, which around here is a rare thing. And so I have this, just in case, just in case we're all actually ever maybe possibly going to get a good family picture someday. Wow. Things are getting messy around here. So there's not just one wallet in my purse. There are <laughs> two more. And this one is actually where I keep everybody's various insurance cards. And so they're easy to find. And this one is where I actually keep like gift cards and just like, um, not just gift cards, gift cards and like membership cards and then also things that we don't use very often. So that's because this purse got just so full of like random cards that I wasn't using very often that I ended up getting this like backup purse. So got backup wallet. Okay, we finally made it to wipes. Now this is where things get totally crazy. There are a lot of snacks in here apparently. Teddy grams, generic teddy grams, just random Myers, Myers alphabet cookie crackers, Cheez-Its, more te generic teddy grams from Aldi, mini chocolate chip cookies, some tissue paper, that's trash, a little baggy thing of hand sanitizer that has not been opened to be used yet. fish crackers, a bow for Tessie's hair, a flyer for the kids dance school that tells us when rehearsal times are. There's like four rehearsals that I have to go to between the two of them. Gastroenterology oral electrolyte split dose preparation, an empty cheese it thing, an empty Easter egg, a Easter candy that someone smuggled in here. Three different pens, some concealer, a tongue depressor, and I believe this one's flavored like banana, and the pulmonologist that gave this to Patrick convinced him that he would be in trouble with the nurses if he knew that he was giving it to Patrick, and so Patrick thought it was like this really cool top secret thing, and I think that's why it's in my purse right now. A little outlet magnetic stamp, um, a receipt that's getting thrown out. Tic Tacs, a straw from McDonald's, and yeah, there's some feminine products in here, and that is pretty much, that is, oh, there was a little gecko magnet, I wonder where the little catboy magnet is, Patrick probably has it, and then there's the side pockets, we're almost done, don't worry, there are, is, is my favorite lip gloss, there's a little thing of tissues, it's going to be like 50 million scraps of paper, you about that in a minute. There's Sadie's chopstick, Pepsi flavored. Oh, yay, the little protective case for the memory card connector thing for my computer, the memory card reader. And then now in the bottom of this, I need like something that keeps this, these from flying all over the place. Oh, a key. I have no idea what this key's to. A key that looks like a lion. Okay, so like all these little scraps of paper are some little beads that came off the like a a rosary. Well, I still have the rosary, so I could fix that. And then all these little scraps of paper are from a coloring book that maybe was shredding during mass, and I was picking up and putting in my purse so that they wouldn't be all over the floor of the cry room. And yeah, that is why they are still here with us. Oh, and this little thing was from the 5K, a 5K that I ran, and it was like a little token to get like a hot dog with afterwards. And then more hand sanitizer, another rehearsal schedule, a thing of lip gloss for the girls, lip gloss and chapstick, one of my favorite lipsticks. And this one is Sexy Mother Pucker um, Naked Talent Satin. Oh, and a Clinique Pep Start Pout Perfecting Balm. <laughs> as far as the bottom, I think the bottoms of these packets are like, oh, missing pair of keys. This was helpful. The extra set, as far as keys for my car, giant elastic, and then a whole bunch of little pieces of crayons that were also broken by the same person that shredded the, oh, a 
dollar. And the same person that shreds, oh my gosh, there's so many of them. The same person that shreds coloring book pages also likes to break crayons into little tiny pieces. It's a stim. It's totally a stim stimulation thing. And that's why I'm oh, missing a rosary. I made this one with little beads. The little miraculous metal beads. It's one of my favorites. So that was good buy. And a whole bunch, in addition to the worthless little pieces of crayon, there's also like a whole bunch of change in here. It's like a tip for cleaning out my purse. Sorry. Anyways. I should cut down all this trash for my new part. Maybe speed it up. Oh, a button that fell off of something very, very pink. I'm not throwing away the button just in case I find what I want to. Okay, let me get rid of the trash. And that is what's in my diaper bag. Hit the subscription button and hit that notification bell so that you don't miss any of the updates that we have coming up in this hectic month of May. And leave a comment to let me know how your weekend went or whatever else is on your mind. Or if you have any other diaper bag must-have items that I've been missing, that I'm missing in here today. <laughs> I feel like I'm missing something that I usually have in here and I can't think what it is. Diapers, wipes, I should probably have a Tessie outfit. That would make sense. Anyways, that is it for tonight and I will see you guys tomorrow with an update about whether or not I actually got Tessie to sleep and whether or not we were actually able to do the EEG. Bye.